Wow, well this looks bad. 470 TV down, zero tackle. Nearly a max TV disadvantage here. Luckily he's got a remarkably beaten up team, but he's still got loads of blood. Which is just impossible to deal with. His record's terrible. So this is a good bit of TV plus probably. Just insane. He's got... He's only got one cheerleader. I thought he might have had loads of stuff in there. He's got some good stuff though, hasn't he? Like he's got the edge. But no movement with it. Mighty blow. Strength four frenzy. So he's got three frenzy guys. He's got loads of injuries, hasn't he? Holy shit. Right. I want a wizard. Which leaves us. Maybe he's Grashnak to three dice people there. But then you just get Mighty Blowed out. You can probably just get banged out by Mighty Blow. Could get a uh, Shuran's guy. Shuran's. He's got the assassins, they just stab him. <laughs> He'll just get stabbed by the assassins. <laughs> Can't even have Grashnak. <laughs> <laughs> oh god! <laughs> I can't even have Grashnak! Right. I don't want to tackle Beastman, that seems really terrible. How much would it cost? 140. Go Borak and a whiz. It's alright, isn't it? <laughs> oh dear. Black of's really good, but when he can get stabbed he's not so good, is he? I thought about Lou Grip, yeah, I thought about Lou Grip. Yeah. See, if they had the new stars, I could have had Load Grip and uh, Double Drew. That would have been great, wouldn't it? Like, Double Drew's really good. He's genuinely really good. Yeah, Roll Pals is the plan. Hello everybody that I, I didn't say hello to by the way, sorry if I didn't say hello. Hello. The fact he's taken max time is making it look like worst possible matchup. <laughs> <laughs> It currently Walford, there's definitely gonna be more though, isn't there? There's gonna be there's gonna be more, almost certainly, because Blood Bowl 3 has um Well I mean not currently. Okay, in the new tabletop edition, that's not the current tabletop edition, first of all, is it? The forthcoming tabletop edition. There's not many. But in the forthcoming tabletop edition, um in Blood Bowl 3 has Blood Bowl 3 has two of the stars that are currently in Blood Bowl 2016. Which certainly implies that um, that it's going to be, um, yeah, they've got they've got you know the uh, he's got an ad jump assassin. What's the other one got? Jump up. So he hasn't got multiple block. So <laughs> that's an important thing to note, isn't it? Mighty blow either side. Right. Um, so, yeah, there's um, what's it called? Creek, Creek Rust Gouger, is it or whatever? I don't know. Whatever the fuck he is, the uh, the the Verminator, the uh, Rat Ogre Ball and Chain dude. He's in it. 
and the other I don't even know the name of the other one the dark elf guy who's like got a tentacle not a, like a squid mask Squidworth I can't remember what he's called yeah octopus octopus face that's the one yeah octopus face yeah What's this? Tennis players for assassins. <laughs> you know what I'm doing. <laughs> I mean, his win rate's promising, isn't it, Try, But it's... <laughs> He's still got to deal with Dark Elves with a 470 TV advantage. That is a jump up assassin, Ça yeah. Clairement le corps à corps. Le soutien suffira t il à prendre le dessus? Yeah, that's true, Troy, yeah, that's true. Frenzy trap. Gets the pal. Incredibly, no armor breaks. <laughs> Shocking. Oh, he's still got the blitz, though. He's still got the blitz. <laughs> how many burns does he have? God knows how many. Lots. Frenzy trap, yep. Come on, fail and die. Skull, 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 skull. Fuck off. Should have put the mighty blood guys on the outside, shouldn't I? In case of them, I should have thought he would have frenzy trap. He hasn't got dodge. It's nice of him. I mean, some of these might have niggles as well. Minus movement, minus movement, and and a niggle on that assassin. Oh baby, really got to hit him. Minus <laughs> movement and armor. <laughs> Mister Mr. Serve, very good. <laughs> <laughs> it's to <the> serve! <laughs> Mac and throw, that's good. Yeah, that's pretty good. That's that's pretty fucking good. Mr. Mac and throw, yeah. Right. Ça va faire mal. 
Okay. Can he blitz? Yeah, he could blitz, couldn't he? And then it's a... It's a... More skills for him if it's a Kaz. It was not a Kaz. Oh, put him behind there in case of frenzy, that's a good idea, isn't it? Fuck off, man. Jim Shard. <laughs> Surf this warrior, can't he? he might as well. <laughs> he might just surf this warrior. Oh no! <laughs> Like, it's obviously a ridiculous commitment to do it, but it looks like he's starting. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no, he's just totally... He's just frenzy-trapping instead. All right, good. That could have gone badly. Still does. <laughs> Right, it's the Adj one who's the weak one, isn't he? Yeah, he's super weak. Move five. And niggled. This is CCL. Yes, Captain Mellons. The clue is in the title. <laughs> One D pal. I know, I know people don't can't see the title when they say that, but I always reply in the same way I've got to it. Huh? <laughs> oh man, the fireball's kind of tempting there, isn't it? Fireball's kind of tempting. I don't think so, Norik. <laughs> the characters he wants are awful. <laughs> well, there was, there was, there was, we were thinking about Captain Melons to be like Major Guns. If you remember, well, I'm sure you do remember Major Guns. He's gonna get Kaz now, isn't he? After bloody getting four dice on him and doing nothing. No, unbelievable, Jeff. Unbelievable. So we could surf him. We could surf this guy. That that's all right, isn't it? We'll see. We'll see. We'll see if that's a possibility or not first. It is not. Well, no, it is a possibility. Yeah, it's a good possibility, in fact. So then maybe just do sensible moves. He can get stabbed. Oh, I don't want him to get stabbed. Alright, probably 
free surf there. So let's not go crazy. The Blitz got him. <laughs> yeah, of course I'm afraid of Armour 9 Stab. Have you seen any game I've ever played, Nekton? <laughs> You're joking, aren't you? <laughs> I don't want him to be able to just run down here, do I really? So I probably want to keep leave him there, actually. Yeah, okay. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Never mind. No, that's the thing, isn't it? It's one in six to break your armor, which is which is quite good, really, isn't it? Like a free shot at just at just casting out Borak. That's that's fucking brutal. It's like that's not in a, like no risk as well, right? No turnover. That's pretty brutal in Blood Bowl. It's one of the reasons why assassins aren't very good because they are actually pretty fucking dangerous. So, so because they're pretty dangerous, you've got to like play around them a bit, which is what makes them crap because obviously they're defenseless armor seven usually. So you've got to go for them because they're actually pretty bloody good. And it's just, just doesn't really help help out their cause much, does it? <laughs> and he's set up the, against the against the uh, frenzy trap here, but he's going to start with a uphill or a one D into a two. What's he going to do? Can I surface frenzy player next turn? Probably. <laughs> I think I could. I think I could surf him. <laughs> Wouldn't need that many extra players in either. Push him to there, push him to there. An extra player in here, push him to there. An extra player in there, but push him, in fact I don't even need to play then push him there, push him to there, push him to there and then push him out, so I just need two extra players <laughs> brilliant now he's going to hit the other one and he, he avoided the frenzy trap, well done well done That's a surf there, isn't it? Beautiful. Hey, <laughs> good night. We can try and punch this guy over to, uh, over to, uh, what's this guy called? Borak. Didn't get to Borak. Right, that is a surf. Surfingtons. Borak probably wants to go centre, doesn't he? Oh no, keep him back there. With him there. Him there. Yep. He can stay there to keep him on his toes. Not really on his toes, on his back. 
New dad doing all right actually. This this is a horrific matchup in TV, but he is uh, either new to Blood Bowl or just bad at Blood Bowl. One of the two. So there is hope, but it's with Blood Bowl. It's the hope that gets you, isn't it? <laughs> so maybe it's not that good that there's hope. Didn't do his. Uh, didn't do his. Take a step. Hundred, hundred games, I guess, is new still, isn't it? Really, especially like depends if how much you've tried to learn, isn't it? Like, that's the thing. It does depend how how hard you've tried to get better. If like if you stuck to the in-game stuff, you're gonna struggle to get better, aren't you? Yeah, so I guess he is new with a hundred games. <laughs> yeah, fifth, sixty-eight this season. Yeah, all right, fair enough. Wow, that's a lot of games. He's keen then, isn't he? Hey! Boo! <laughs> I thought the uh, thought the frenzy traps were finally gonna get him. Instead, it's a removal. Boo! But he's down to one reroll. So that's something. Yeah, kind of leader, isn't it? It's not it's not full leader, but he's got like he's got semi leader. Yeah, Tom Schnees, yeah. <laughs> yep, yep. He's done on reroll though, so something could happen. Something could happen. It does, yes, Nectarne, yep. He's also got Sneaky Git as well. Hello, Zenai. And, uh, and Sneaky Git's a lot better. So he's actually... I've run out of time. Okay, that's, that's nearly as good. <laughs> Running out of time would have been better, but <laughs> that was nearly... That was nearly great, anyway. Strength four over there. I guess I've got to. Punch her might as well. Hey, you got a foul. Do I blitz him? Or her? Block him first. Oh, 
would have been nice to be able to 3D her, wouldn't it? I don't feel the Borag foul, no. <laughs> Things are getting a stab already, might as well. Just It's either blitz him or bracket him, isn't it? I think I'm going to blitz him and go over the other side. Stop the jump up. What a genius. And go over there to cover her. Come up here to cover him. Hello, Frosty. Because uh, I'd already stood up, I'd stood up, J5, there was no follow up. It. The other guys had moved. Oh, you mean fuck blitz him into Borak? But then I'm then I'm at the mercy of jump up. And he doesn't have mighty blow. So they are two reasons. Why well, I just didn't even think about it. <laughs> does stab stab does not combine with mighty blow. Oh do you mean does 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 stab get better? You don't really want stab to get better though, do you? Because the problem is with stab, like if you make you don't want to make dark elves even better, do you? That's crazy, Juicy K. Maybe it maybe there's something wrong. Like with your firewall or some bollocks. Oh god, that's really bad, isn't it? Could have cut the corner with dodge. Doesn't matter. Oh PS4, alright, oh yeah, that explains it then. <laughs> yeah, it's probably it's probably dead then. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's probably dead on PS4. Sorry. <laughs> I play on Xbox. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> well, you've just said you've tried three nights in the last week and have had no luck finding a game, and then you said it's pretty active, but. <laughs> it, yeah, more active than Xbox. Yeah, it's always been more active than Xbox, hasn't it? Oh no, I play on Xbox. <laughs> hey. One reroll, will he use it? Does he go to the J5 school of rerolls? He certainly does. Oops, you shouldn't have bothered. <laughs> yes! Oh, outstanding! Absolutely outstanding! I know, but it's a meme, isn't it? I've got to bloody do it. <laughs> right, he wants his touchdown. Get up there. <laughs> get up there and get your touchdown, you prick. <laughs> Is he is he niggled? No. The blitz the assassin who's gone is, isn't he? There was I thought there was another one. Good player. So I guess I should uh, 
do some safe moves first. J5 reroll. <laughs> That's a good point, Bessel. Yeah, that's a good point. Oh, he didn't jump up, Star. <laughs> Time for Borak to start fouling. No, it isn't. Second half try, he could. Second half, he could foul. He could foul that bloody mighty blow witch elf if he gets the chance. Oh, is he going to do a passing play here? He certainly is. And he's just going to stand there like a dickhead. He's just going to stand there like a dickhead. Fair enough. <laughs> no right, J5. <laughs> hey, he's double one. Never lucky. All right, 3D with with uh, Borak first. Fuck. nice <laughs> very nice yeah you can you can reach the rich pretty sure glorious no I won't give in until I'm victorious and I will defend. I will defend. Another month, another kebab worth of money to Jimmy. <laughs> Glorious, thank you very much. Thank you very much, Moridam, for glorious, glorious kebab money. Thank you very much. Yes, Lemon, yep. Yeah. So he can react afterwards, but he can also react afterwards now. I've got nerves of steel, and I tagged him. What an idiot. What a literal idiot. I should have tagged, double tagged her. What a literal idiot.
Uh, no, she rolled a four. So she would have she would have caught if I double tagged. But still, double tagging was still the right play, wasn't it? Sebab outside the EU is like eating ice cream made out of rotting cadavers. <laughs> Mr. Yemendam, it's true. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> to be fair, I don't think that that's kind of wrong, though, isn't it, Mr. Yemendam? That's kind of wrong because uh, they're from Turkey, aren't they? And Turkey's in the EU, and they'll have nice kebabs, whereas. The England are still in the EU for a little bit and uh, have disgusting kebabs. There you go. Boom. Um. <laughs> yeah, I'd be sorry. Yeah, there you go. And also, that extra player would have been where she do just dodged to. Though she'd have still made the rolls, to be fair. Oh, it still is for now, though, kill, isn't it? Still is for now. <laughs> the home of Co-op is Germany. Yeah, it is, isn't it? It is. Even though they got the idea off the Turks. It's the Krauts what perfected it. <laughs> oh, good, he's run away from my scoring threat. That was nice of him. I wanted to go for the pickup, didn't I? I probably should move these fuckheads first. Like, having these allows him to stop the score. But I really just don't want him to score. <laughs> it's kind of more important, isn't it? Be sensible. Oh, I'd use my reroll. Oh, he caught it anyway. Oh, yeah, of course he used my reroll. Maybe I could have used my wizard at some point during that game. Like when I blitzed the dump off guy, maybe I should have just bolted him. And then might have been one nil up. But now the wizard is like good against uh against a blitz or whatever, isn't it? Or if you roll some crazy dice on defense. So it's not terrible to have it as a in the pocket. He's down in player quality, if not in numbers. Yeah, now he can jump up me, yeah. <laughs> I 
Yes, yeah. Frenzy and Grab would be pretty OP. Seems in good time to won the bolt. <laughs> yeah, maybe I should have brought. If I, do you know what? If I'd known that the runner had no of steel, I probably would have bolted him. To be fair. Oh, for fuck's sake. Hey! <laughs> He still, he can still score though. Stupidly, he can still score. Not if he fucks it up, I guess. No. <laughs> Phew. <laughs> wow. That's crazy that he could have still scored. It wouldn't have even been unlikely, would it? With, uh, you know, two one Ds on the ball. And then, especially if he powered it on the second and, like, the ball went out there or whatever. It would have been just to scoot off, pick it up, run around, pass it. Would have been pretty easy. Said he looked uphill. He has himself. <laughs> yeah, he was, he was really close to scoring, actually. Crazy. Ooh la la! No cards for the beast man. Jim Shard. Uh, oh yeah, with the with the with witcher, yeah, yeah, with the other witch, yeah, he could have done. But he wasn't gonna, was he? <laughs> um the nerves of steel intercept is actually means that we've got to try and do the dodges first. Away from away from <laughs> movement five shadowing. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> the movement five. Oh no, this is the movement six one. The other one's the movement five one. Oh shit. <laughs> Fucking assassin, man. Too good. <laughs> Too good. <laughs> Fucked by shadowing. <laughs> Absolutely banged on by shadowing. No good, he stays out. I think he's only got nine then. Three, six, nine, yeah. Full eleven, thanks to Borak. <laughs> Space was right. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it was going to be a long bomb anyway, right? So it probably wasn't going to be a touchdown anyway. But Both Nerves of Steel and Shadowing doing something that turn. <laughs> and really, the, the Nerves of Steel was... Well, I still misplayed. So it, it would have done something. Kind of. On offence. Still, the ball in the pocket or fireball in the pocket is nice, isn't it? Should be a 1 0 win. Do we just carry on the 10 SPP guy? So he's got block, he's got to uphill a block character to get the ball. 
Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I think that was definitely the. You know, I could have obviously I could have blitzed with a warrior or whatever, but I think it was it was the touchdown was so unlikely it was better to not try. <laughs> Looking pretty bad against the Blitz here. Yeah, to be fair, I thought it was. I thought he was movement five shadowing. Um, which is obviously not as good. <laughs> Hello, dear haunter. Oh, that was a completely inept LOS, wasn't it? <laughs> Two knockdowns, no AV breaks. <laughs> oh dear. Pick up fail, reroll gone. <laughs> that was uh, that was not good. Do you mean stunty teams, Rotten Husk? Because stunty as a skill is pretty good. Like uh, skinks are pretty great. Uh, <laughs> why are they so bad? Um, yeah, I mean, well, because they're they're meant to be. Well, why are they meant to be? Because, because even though Lord of the Rings is one of the most popular books ever, having little, short, tiny, little fat men be the greatest warriors on earth is a bit fucking stupid, isn't it? <laughs> oh, I hate this guy rerolling his wonders. Hello, Pablo's. Hello, dear trick.
Yeah, he can't break through at least. Uh, dwarves are the one. <laughs> no, I know they save it. They save the world because they're immune to fucking magic and bollocks. But it's still fucking dark. It's a stupid, stupid book. Just have the elves do everything. Elves are the best. Why would you bother with non-elf races? Lame. Right, one, two, three, four, five. So I'll get him to here. And him to here. And leave him there. Oh, if I'd he can go one further back. Where does he go? Does he base her? I mean, she can't really reach, can she? And that's really unlucky. So maybe just leave him there, because he stops these guys coming through. 3D with Borak. Yeah, boy. Nothing. Hey, picked it up. Glorious. Do I base him for something to do? Double base him. Yes, double base him. <laughs> Just a joke. <laughs> I'll tell you subscribers. Really, if you if you could if you care about what other people think about things you like, then you're wrong. <laughs> Um, he wouldn't fix it if Jim McMahon is his head Blood Bowl developer. He would not fix Dunty teams to be on the same level playing field as non-shit teams because he'd want the he'd want the vanilla midgets to be crap, wouldn't he? <laughs> Rebel full of people. <laughs> Go back to your cave. <laughs> <laughs> I, you know, I, don't, I don't know for me right you've got elves who are just brilliant at everything and tall and sexy and brilliant and then you've got dwarves who are just little short fat scruff bags and halflings who are shorter and fatter and weaker they're even worse than dwarves why you know it just seems like why would you have these as the heroes just have glorious elves. <laughs> yeah, I'd stun you to dwarves, it'd be fun, wouldn't it? <laughs> Do you know what? I would make I would make big guys better, for sure. For sure I would make big guys better. Um I would absolutely make big guys better. I think in the fluff the big guys are the best and people in the actual real game people don't want to use them because they're rubbish people shouldn't want to use something that's hyped as the best thing in the game because it's rubbish should they like that's a failure that's a fundamental failure of the game isn't it <laughs> I've got nothing against Short, fat, scruff bag, screw or I'm nearly one. If I was a couple of inches shorter, I've got the fat and the scruff bag. But I know that I couldn't beat <laughs> a guy who's six foot six and, uh, you know, super fast and coordinated and uh, a sexual Tyrannosaurus. I just couldn't beat him in a fight, could I? I know that. That's fine. I've got a mighty blow blitz something that's good. <laughs> good job it was three dice. <laughs> yeah, this'll <old> power. <laughs> Will it fuck? <laughs> oh dear. Hey, 
can block her, but he can't go. Oh, I guess he could chain her. He's not going to chain him out. Yeah. Yeah, Lemon is good. Look at bloody Orlando Bloom. He's just, you know, how could, how could, how could a tiny little Frodo compare to him? Crazy. Also, Tyson would get smashed by all of the best of all time. Sorry. He was a great can opener though. I'll give him that. And obviously he would kill me. <laughs> again. <laughs> again, you know, I'm not comparing. <laughs> um, <laughs> I'm not comparing myself to any of these people. Hello, Tony. What do I do here? I want to blitz him with Bora because it's three dice with my E, but then he's not my player, is he? Hashtag not my player. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five. I can't hit with my E, but let's three dice here with block first, see what happens. Go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, it'd be a GFI, so I can't I just can't do that. So it's gotta be with Bora. It's three dice. Just trundle forward. I've got two left. No. Fucked it. Doesn't matter. Go there to keep her in. Ain't go there to keep him in. Ain't no blitz. Ces joueurs sont tout proches. Le combat paraît inévitable. Ça me rappelle la célèbre histoire Nurgling et Gant Immonde. Et son miracle, c'est tout ici. Get smashed by Big Ham. <laughs> Big Ham the wrestler would, yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, I mean Tyson, old as he is, would still absolutely murder every normal person in the fight, wouldn't he? But also he would get he would you know get he would he would probably like get seriously injured if he fought uh, Tyson Fury, wouldn't he? So. Firefly. Yes! Exactly, Rick. We could, we could beat him at Blood Bowl. We've got that going for us. <laughs> oh yeah, it is Skuro's fault single-handedly, isn't it? That's true. I forgot that. <laughs> it's annoying that with six men he can actually get in the way. Like I've got a bolt. I'll have. I guess I can bolt him later, so it's not so bad. Hey. Can abandon all these guys now. Stop them back there. Can get these forward. Jam in. I really want to blitz that way, but I don't know why. So I probably shouldn't then, should I? Jam in this way. Oh, 
calling my players. Not a problem. He's got to go there. <laughs> Yeah, it does come the jump up star, but it's not so bad, is it, on turn 13? I haven't removed anyone this half. He's still on 9, that's crazy, isn't it? Not to have removed anyone with all those 3 dice with mighty blows. <laughs> <laughs> Single-handedly score. <laughs> yeah. Heck. Oh god, what a crazy group it is, isn't it? Skuro got the worst draw. Maybe, maybe Gadenix, a Firefly fan. Skuro got the absolute worst draw. It's ridiculous. I'll uh, I'll post it here for you. <laughs> it's literally the worst. Somebody had to get Hawker in the first round, which is literally the worst possible first round you can get if he shows up. Which he might not show up. He didn't show up the last one. But if Hawker shows up, that is absolutely the worst person you can get in the first round. So he managed to achieve that. Then he got Elliot in the second round, which is. <laughs> Which is probably the worst person you can get in the second round. <laughs> so he's managed to nail the absolute worst one too for himself there, Skuro. And then he's up against, you know, Dark Elves or Zons, which, okay, that's not so bad. Should be able to handle them. And then uh, in the final versus somebody, fair enough. But it's just two more games, that's the thing. Um, Mr. Light and Calcium have got to fight each other in the first one, that's pretty horrible. Worst possible matchup for Calcium in terms of racial matchup, and obviously Mr. Light's done quite well in CCL before, so I don't think he'll be overjoyed at his draw there, Calcium. And uh, yeah, I mean the most important thing is just winning four games is hard anyway, isn't it? Like win winning four games against anybody is hard, really, just because blood ball is blood ball, isn't it? got to blitz him. I'm going to open with a 3D from him just because it's 3D and it means someone else can blitz. Nice. I got to move through straight away. That's nice, isn't it? One, two, three, four, five. Got a full cage here. Without rolling dice. Well, okay, apart from that 3D. <laughs> apart from the loner 3D. That started the turn. He could, he could, no, I can only 2D, he could 3D. But I've got three rerolls, so who cares? Whoa, that would have been bad. <laughs> Go on, power his bludger. J5, school of reroll management. Oh, I play on Xbox. Oh, no. I tried, J5. I tried. Two break tackle, yeah, I would, no, I think six blocks better. Yeah, okay, fair enough, Bezel, fair enough. Bezel! 
Yeah, I'd turn 15 is the bolt, isn't it, to make sure that I can get through to score. Okay, KO's fine. I'll bash this half. <laughs> it's the first removal of the half. Crazy. No, but I got the the, the bolt. The, the the wizard is re exclusively reserved for helping me score on turn sixteen. Or if they got a blitz, like if they if they got the ball off us somehow with a blitz or whatever, would have bolted instantly then. Maybe I should have bought them defense. To be fair. Turn 15, turn 16, that's score. I don't know why I said turn 15. Turn 16 is when the ball comes out, isn't it? Pro hopefully. Probably. I don't know, it doesn't live a lost. I need to move scoring threats first, don't I, this turn at the moment? <sighs> I guess. There's some scoring threats. Base the ball. <laughs> oh, you fuckhead. <laughs> you absolute fuckhead. <laughs> One dice fucking pal. <laughs> I could bolt her, to be fair. And then blitz this guy and come through easy. It's kind of tempting because that this blitz is really good, then, isn't it? One, two, three, four, five, so I can get to there, which means he wants to be here. Just realised he's got a shadowing, hasn't he? I've got a GFI, I've got a basic. Oh no! Oh no, what a mistake. I could have just been stood there. Phew. I've got to give the jump up stab. I've got to give him the jump up stab, haven't I, for the uh... Otherwise he could base the ball with a shadowing guy. Which would be something else to deal with. So 
Yeah, it was all right, wasn't it? Cheeky 10, 15 ball. Like, that was pretty useful, to be fair, without that. Well, that ball would have been having to blitz, blitz the witch and then block this blodger and then try to squeeze down the side somehow. So it turned out pretty good. Passport's got loads better actually with a new addition. <laughs> On the ball. No Pedro, because then it would have failed. I believe it was a two. There you go. Hey, he failed. Uh, dwarf coach. <laughs> Almost certainly. Seems that was pretty much everything was his idea. Three dice with mighty blow. Got a reroll for it. Might as well. Did I cut it in the wrong one? Oh no, they're both on 10. Okay. I think I see where to score here, yeah. <laughs> Not bad. Um, yeah, the uh, kickoff return and pass block have been combined, but also the restrictions in moving in pass block have been removed. So you, you can just go wherever you want on a pass block now. Which is pretty nice. Got a movement here. I don't think he's in any danger of one turning. But you never know. Anyone can look at a guide, can't they? Oh, Borak on the LOS. Yeah, fucking Borak. Have some of that. But they were absolutely rock hard today. <laughs> yeah, five, three, five, so seven. Cock. <laughs> Niggled as well. What a player. <laughs> oh no, he's not, is he? No, the other ones were. There were so many niggle players, I didn't know who had them, to be honest. <laughs> I play on Xbox. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Goliath. Oh, hey, Wanger. <laughs> it's always Wanger. It's always Wanger. It's always uh, it's always Goliath with the Xbox, isn't it? Soon to be despoiled. Hi, kid. Good. Wanger is in the JFW Kilmatronics, and he is my best friend in real life. <laughs> no, hey, Wanger happened. During a glorious promo, do you know what? We should put all the JFW promos on a on a channel on my Discord so people can see like Rick's 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 uh, Rick's amazing promos and and uh, the one that Skuro edited of me and Wanger, which was amazing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he, yeah, he does do that. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> I don't know if he's one of the many. <laughs> <laughs> it is something he does in his spare time. <laughs> yeah, probably. He's probably not the only one. Thankfully, it's not my caravan, so I don't care. You could. Two it to two this if he wants, can't he? No, he can't. Not without the extra player. Probably don't even risk it in Borak. He's such a bad ass. He's failed the pass. Hey. <laughs> not that I know of, Lemon. <laughs> not that I know of. <laughs> I mean, he has despoiled. He has just spoiled many a hotel room. Uh, generally with his ass rather than jerking off. Um, hello, Mr. Pants, and hello, Captain Flugnoogle, and thanks. <laughs> um, no, kiss a 10 no. They actually made up specially crap. Oh, he got the MVP as well as the touchdown! Yes! Um, they actually made specially made new crap throwing skills to make them 12 skills. So. Like they split apart accurate and stuff. Terrible. They 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 broke up accurate and strong arm. Absolutely ridiculous. Do you just go mighty blow on all of these? I wonder if that's an idea. Get the guard faster. <laughs> the classic, the classic stupidity of take mighty blow to get the guard faster. But I mean, it gets you more SPPs total, doesn't it? And you're not that far away from guard. But, um... <laughs> it's kind of tempting to go Mighty Blow. It certainly works on ladder for him, doesn't it? It doesn't work in playoffs, because he, he doesn't play well enough in playoffs. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's the thing. He's got two of the levels. In like, if you go Block Guard, you're finished. And you don't need anything more. If going mighty blow is just greed, going greed for a greed fifty SPP warrior, isn't it? With a block guard, claw mighty, basically, you're basically choosing to go for a greed player then. Whereas if you go block guard, then you're just finished, which is nice to have finished players, isn't it? Um, yeah, but I mean, you don't need that many. Like I've never, okay, I mean, I have gone five on a team, but generally, <laughs> they, they, they got they got piling on as they're like fifth skill the guy like most of them so you don't have to uh you don't have to do that anyway we'll see think about it thanks for watching don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic